Hi, I'm Vanessa. I'm doing my master's in retail management. I've been working out in this gym from the past uh, six months, five to six months. And uh, I'm just here to tell you about uh, the difference between a, a general training and a personal training. Uh, so far, my experience was that when I was doing a general training, I used to have my limits and I had no one to push me around. So I used to slowly lag around and you know work out. But PT is something where you know it. Uh, your trainer will show you different type of variations to work out. There's a motivation. Your trainer will actually feel, make you feel comfortable in doing you. Give you that push, right push, and you know getting the right uh, you know uh, target you want to. So that's the difference between a general trainer training and a personal training. So I prefer that if you want fast results and if you want the right training, you should always go for a personal training that, rather than a general training. It cannot be compared to a personal training. Uh, my feedback about this gym is that I was previously working out in a bigger gym with a bigger ambience and uh, to say much better machines. But uh, what I felt about this gym was even if it's small, it makes you feel so comfortable that you work out comfortably. And that's what you all need to work out with, you know, that right kind of motivation and, uh, you know, the right kind of push you need. And, uh, you know, you should always feel, you know, you, all, you should always feel comfortable when you walk into a gym and not very, uh, you, know, uh, con you know, unconscious when you come into a gym. So, and uh, when I was working out in the previous gym, I didn't get results as much faster as I got over here. So, uh, that's what I have to tell about a general training and a personal training and, and that's a comparison between uh, my older gym and this gym.